To face an Ajax youth team in Amsterdam could be an intimidating experience for any side, but not for Aston Villa, who arrived in the Dutch capital full of confidence after finishing runners-up in a group containing Sporting Lisbon, PSV and Celtic. The Dutch masters, powerful as always at academy level, also finished second in their group behind next-gen series revelation CSKA Moscow and ahead of Chelsea and Molder of Norway. The beginning of the match saw Ajax playing from the back and taking risks with a huge ball possession. But Aston Villa and their striker and next-gen series top scorer, Mickey Drennan, were prepared to make the most of it with their super-fast counter-attacks. Like this chance for number eight, Samir Carruthers, when many claimed it was a penalty. All this with the Ajax first team head coach Frank de Boer watching from the stands. 16 minutes gone and a powerful run by Leslie de Saar from the left. The perfect pass found at Jarvan Anderson to put mighty Ajax 1-0 up. Ajax in full control with the quarterfinals in sight. But Villa were having none of it. 36 minutes gone and Graham Burke's perfect assist found Mickey Drennan as the amazing Irish striker finished off with a super touch. Another name to remember from this next-gen series, Mickey Drennan, 1-1, Villa back in the game and things started to change with the English team beginning to take control of the ball. Now it was the Dutch under pressure. Sixty-five minutes into the game now, and once again the outstanding Samir Carruthers put in the perfect cross for Brad Lewis, who finished superbly to finish Ajax off and send Aston Villa, one of the most prolific academies in England, to the next-gen quarter-finals. Aston Villa head coach Tony McAndrew and assistant Sean Verity planned to take the game to the Dutch had paid off. And Ajax, one of the hot favourites to win this season's next-gen series, and one of the most traditional academies in world football, were eliminated in their own backyard. <laughs> Uh, we're absolutely delighted by the, the kids' performance. We, uh, we've worked for a few days now on a, on a, on a game plan uh, and they stuck to it and they, they worked their socks off and really put into practice what we've been practicing for two or three days. Uh, got a little bit of luck at times, but I think uh, we played well on the, on the counter-attack. Against a team with the quality of the Ajax guys, you, you have to make sure you defend properly. Uh, and, I, and I think we defended, we defended well. As I said, we got a little bit of luck at times, but we were we were always dangerous on the break and created some good chances and, and managed to score some good goals. So, absolutely delighted. Yeah, well, uh, the, disappointed about the result. Um, I think uh, my team not deserved to lose the game, but uh, it was only one moment. Um, we were really, uh, yeah, we didn't look good in, at the back. Um, and they scored uh, their second goal and as far as I know uh, the game was I think level um, both sides uh, didn't create a lot of chances but um, then it's only about the details and uh, well for us today it went the other way the wrong way and uh, disappointed because we would like to go on in the next year because these games are, are really good for the for our players to, to learn and to develop so uh, it's a pity route, and, uh, but that's, uh, that's football and you have to accept it. And uh, I wish uh, Aston Villa good luck in the next round. Yeah, we're, uh, we're all buzzing now, loving it, great game. Hold, hard to hold on for the last 20 minutes, but team held out well, so we're happy. Not bothered, as we said, this next-gen 
tournament is, is fantastic experience for the players and no matter who we play we'll 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 embrace it and we'll learn from it and we'll 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 try and get these kids some more education which is what this is all about this is a marvelous night for us coming to Ajax and, and, and playing against fantastic side and, and getting a result